zero point zero. Good morning, Indy Nation. I'm Qasem Ahmed. And I'm Kelly Barclay, and this is Indy Nation News, live on Friday morning. Here's what you need to do as you start your day. Order sunglasses now to help support prom. Wear them to school events and around your community. Your future is bright. Sales will last through Sunday the 20th. Indy Water City Hockey is back on the ice again, Friday, at the Ashburn Ice House. The Tigers take on rival Briarwoods at 9 p.m. in the first round of the playoffs. February is Black History Month, and all month long we are honoring and celebrating the accomplishments of black Americans. I-9 reporter Clinton Wakajezi has today's report. It was good in the nation. It's Clinton here, and today we're going to be talking about George Washington Carver. George Carver was an American scientist who helped make many inventions that prevented soil depletion. George Carver should be more well known for his inventions because a lot of his inventions are used in current day agriculture for farmers. All right, thanks for listening. That's all the time I have. Hope you guys have a great school day, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace. In honor of Black History Month, the Black Student Union celebrates the culture of black hair. From hairstyles to hair products, African American hair is a statement of black history and expression. Stop by the displays case on the corner of the math and science hallways to view aspects of black hair culture. Good luck to the Indy Swim Team as they finish up their season by competing in states on Saturday. INN is always working for you. And here is this week's Snack or Whack. Welcome back to Snack or Whack. I'm Kelly. I'm Lilia. Okay, we just bought a Mike and Ice and a Hawaiian Punch, and now we're going to see if it's Snack or Whack. Okay, so the Hawaiian Punch, it was $2. Um, it's pretty cold, so that's pretty good. Um, I wouldn't mind drinking this during lunch, but I wouldn't recommend it for like breakfast, to be honest. Um, but you know what? I'll give it like a 7 out of 10. It's a, lot, it's a lot of flavor. I think I would read it personally a 6 out of 10. I mean, it only has 11 grams of sugar, so it's not too bad, but in the morning it's too much. And after you agree with Kelly, it is pretty hard to chew. Again, I wouldn't eat this for breakfast. Um, probably not even lunch, to be honest. I would probably eat it like after school or something. Um, but I'll rate it like a seven out of 10 again. They're a little hard to chew, but I would think that's because it's cold. I think I would give it an eight out of 10. Okay, so we decided that both the fruit punch and the mica knife are both snack instead of whack. They're very edible. Yes, they are very edible. Um, again, I would, wouldn't recommend it for breakfast, but if that's the way you swing, then go ahead. Scan the QR code so you can give us a suggestion on what to try next on Snack or Whack. Thanks for watching. That's all the time we have for this edition of Any Nation News. Have a great weekend, and we will see you right back here next week. Thank you.